Hey everybody, Ben here with Diesel Power Products, and today we are talking about connector tubes. This is going to cover the 2003 to 2022 5.9 and 6.7 liter Cummins. Now, you can see there's two injector tubes in front of me. There's a little bit of a split there. The 5.9 liter common rail engines, that's going to be from 2003 to 2007, used this darker option here, which is the OEM spec Bosch connector tube. Nothing wrong with this tube, that's just what came from the factory. However, in 07 and a half, when they switched to the 6.7 liter Cummins, a little bit larger engine, a little bit larger injector, more displacement, they moved on to this updated option from Bosch, which is going to be uh, going to cover the 07 and a half to 2022 6.7 liter Cummins. It is pretty common for folks to put this style injector connector tube into the 5.9 liter Cummins. Why? Well, it has a little bit larger inner diameter. So if you plan on running a larger injector or you're just trying to get better performance out of your truck, going with the later style connector tube or retrofitting it onto the 5.9 liter Cummins is very, very common and honestly a great upgrade. As far as fitment goes, they fit in the exact same spot. They've both got little detents here and they've both got O-rings on there to seal into uh, the head and then into the injector. Now you may be thinking to yourself, do I have to replace my connector tubes? The answer is yes. When you are re removing the injectors from the engine, you're gonna be taking the connector tubes out. There is no O-ring, there is no sealing, there isn't anything between the connector tube and the injector. It is a pressure fit. So as you screw this in and it cinches down onto the injector, it is a metal to metal connection. And you've got a lot of high pressure fuel going through these connector tubes. We're talking anywhere from four to 6,000 PSI at idle, all the way up to, I don't know, 26, 27, 28,000 PSI. If you've got a pressure relief block off on there and you're running some heavy tuning, you might even see higher than that. That's a lot of pressure to be going through a connection that has just a metal to metal uh, sealing surface there. So what happens is the injector will start making circles or indents on the end of this connector tube. And if you start having too many circles there, you start bleeding off pressure. You start bleeding off pressure, you get lower injection pressure with the injectors, decreased performance, decreased power, all the kind of stuff that us as diesel guys, we don't want. So as cheap insurance, if you are going to be replacing your injectors, it is highly, highly, highly recommended that you replace the connector tubes as well. Last thing to note, these are sold individually. So if you are replacing all of your injectors, you're gonna to wanna to make sure and add quantity six of these to the shopping cart to make sure that you get a new connector tube for every single one of your injectors. If you have any questions on these Bosch connector tubes, feel free to give us a shout. We've got phone technicians on the phones, 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. Pacific time, Monday through Friday, happy to answer any questions you may have. Other ways to get a hold of us, you can use the chat feature on the website, you can hit us up on the social medias, send us an email, smoke signal, whatever works best for you. We are happy to answer any questions, and thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next one.